going on ladies and gentlemen welcome back to another episode of the resident evil 2 remake part number five for leon's campaign we have so much to get through i want to welcome you guys back to another terrifying episode my name is unreal royale and let's not waste any more time i just came out of a very sticky situation and so i am not going back that way but instead i think i'm going to have to come back and go back to the police department station because we still have some stuff for us to unlock and get to, so I want to welcome you all back right now. This has to be my favorite game thus far. This game is so immersive, I can't even begin to tell you guys how much I just have grown to adore this game. So, I want to see if I can go back to the Raccoon City Police Department upstairs because I have a hunch about certain things. Now, what do I have here? I have a crank. Now, I think I'm going to use this to unlock something upstairs. I still have, you know, this key to use here alongside many other things. I do have very scarce ammunition, so let's just see how far we can get to. So again, guys, if you guys are new to this channel, hit that subscribe button, everybody. Turn on all notifications. Slap a like down below if you guys are happy that I will be bringing you guys more of the RE2 content. How the hell do I leave this place? Because I can't really go back the way I came. Oh, this sucks, man. Okay, so... I'm gonna have to figure things out a different way. Now this ladder is gonna send me down here. However, I need I need to go back desperately that way. So um, this sucks, man. Okay, so thankfully enough, I realized that Mr. X is in the game, but Mr. X hasn't really caught on to us because everyone was saying, "Yo, man, once you get to Mr. X, it's over." So I believe you guys. I believe that once we get to Mr. X, it's basically all over from there, but I'm limping, I have Ebola, and I'm trying to figure things out. So, as a matter of fact, um, since I can't go this way, let me see if I can take myself up upstairs and see if I can figure things out. Guys, I might jump back on this game later on this year because um, there's just so much about this game that's so well uh, crafted, so well done that really it just immerses you like in, in the entire world that you're in so uh what is this portable safe can't use that uh keys obviously can't use that i can't use anything right now man uh is there any way for me to use this exit is it possible is it possible damn all right uh i don't know if you guys heard that i just heard a noise out there somewhere and i'm not trying to figure out what it was or what it is so let me see if i can go through here we have the firing range there are certain things i need to get through and go through but it's going to be really difficult because i need to figure things out uh because I, I need to get to the generator room i really do however this is locked the jail well actually wait do i have any uh okay i don't all right because we need to get to the uh the holding cell over here because there's obviously an electrical door panel here so i think i need a piece for that so with all that being said, there's a uh, there's a room over here which I've explored but I don't want to go through. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go through here real quick. Oh god, thankfully there's no zombies here. I want to go this way. I want to check some stuff out because I, I have a feeling that we haven't uncovered everything. Oh man, so as long as those dogs stay in those cages, that's all I care about. What is this? What the hell is this? Uh, High-grade gunpowder, yellow. Uh, what is this supposed to be? Nah, I'm not really feeling that, to be honest. Because I could come across something I, I am going to need. So, man, this is some spooky stuff. You guys have no idea. Okay, so, so as long as those dogs stay in those cages, I should be fine. There's three of them, by the way. Oh! Alright, so, I really don't know what to expect. But I want to see if I can figure some stuff out. Because there are certain things to me that do make sense and don't make sense and i need to figure out the things that do make sense to me because then that could be my key to escaping but imagine being put in a situation like this to where you legitimately have no way out it's like you're trapped underground in this parking lot you know beneath this freaking police station or whatever so oh yes there we go okay uh let me use this uh, crank here all right let's see what lies beyond the horizon what lies behind door number one? Let's figure things out. Oh boy. Uh, I'm nervous. Okay, uh, my anxiety. I'm gonna have a, an anxiety attack. Hello? Anybody on the other side here? Okay, it's nothing here. Oh boy. Alright, uh, just a bunch of junk. There's a door right here. Uh, let me see if I can check this place for anything. Nope. Alright, so let's just go through door number one. Uh, hello? This looks spooky. Uh, nothing here to my, uh... 
to my peril. Um, well, I don't know. I, well, actually, what's this? Can I pick this up? Yes. Uh, boxed electrical parts. Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. So if I, let me examine that for a second, because if I'm not mistaken, it's a box. There has to be something in this box, no? If I'm out, there, there, there we go, yep. All right, what's inside here? Let's see. An electrical part. Okay, I think we need that for the jail cell downstairs. So that's a good thing. However, let me see what's on the other side. I am just so nervous because I really, this game immerses you in this world and it makes it feel like so real hello anybody down there hello my first oh, oh did you guys hear that did you guys just hear that oh man my first day on the force i'm out here in this abandoned parking lot where a zombie apocalypse is taking place uh what is this a generator i think it is um all right i'm just gonna take my guess uh i'll just turn this on and i'll turn that on did anything work? Uh, yes. Okay. We're good to go. Oh, wait. Oh, no. The dogs. The dogs. The dogs. The dogs. The dogs. The dogs. Uh, oh, crap. I'm going to have a panic attack. I'm going to have a panic attack live on this on this episode. Oh, God. There it is. Back. Back, puppy. Just just how many dogs are there? I have no idea. Back, back, back. No. Oh, okay. You missed. Yay. Oh, God. Yes. Oh, why did I? Oh, why did I just waste that bullet? Okay, is that it? I, I know that there was three of them. There were three of them. So, where's the other one? Where is the second one? Oh, Jesus Christ! Okay, there he is. Yeah! Oh, God! No, no, no! Don't bite me! Don't bite me! Don't bite me! I'm gonna have Ebola! Yeah, he gave me Ebola! No! Back up! Come on, Leon. Blow that dog's head off! Yeet! Alright, is that it? Oh, dude. Oh, man. Any more? Where's the third one? Where's the third one? I'm bit. I have Ebola. And AIDS. Ah! Definitely not my cup of tea. Listen, man. I, I'm, I, can I use that? That did nothing for me. That did nothing for me. How did I use the herbs and they did nothing for me? I'm, I'm basically finished, man. I, I think I'm going to die. There. I mean, I, I don't even know how I'm alive or functioning right now. Did you guys just hear that? I heard glass break. Hello, dog number three? Where you at? It's like Boost Mobile. Where you at? I'm nervous. I'm gonna have a panic attack. Um, all right, so ah, let me just keep going. You guys are probably enjoying this so much, just seeing me suffer. But I'm telling you all right now, this is uh, this is. I, I didn't ask for this. I didn't want to be down here. What is this? Oh, the hell with your gunpowder, bro. What am I gonna do? Snort that shit? Really? I mean, whatever. I'll, I'll still take it because I, I guess I'll combine it with the other thing that I spotted earlier. I'm gonna have to keep moving. Uh, oh, thank Christ. We have some marijuana for us to use. Yep, there we go. All right, so we are on caution. All right, so we're a lot better off than how we were before. But the music is really intense. Uh, where's the other dogs at? Oh, my God. Look at him. Oh, Jesus. How did I miss that? Did I seriously just miss that? All right, this dog's going to have to go down. All right, he's down. I hear another one. I hear more dogs. Where, where are the dogs at? Where are the damn dogs at? Is he over here? Oh, there he is. Back! Back, puppy! Is he also going to crawl through? These dogs have no chill. But wait a minute. Where, where did this, uh... Where did we get a fourth dog? I just wasted another bullet. Where did we get a fourth dog? I thought that there were only three. Or, or maybe I'm wrong. I have no idea. My, my ammo's scarce. Damn, dude. And anything here I can use? Anything at all? Nothing. Listen, who else wants to see a Resident Evil 3 uh, Nemesis remake? Come on. Like, I would pay for that. I, I would love that so much. What the hell was that noise? Oh, Jesus, there's another dog! That's five dogs! Great, now I'm stuck inside this morgue with dead bodies here. And this is what I love about the game. The actual bodies stay there. Like, they, ne they never dissipated or left to begin with. So that's what makes this really fun. Yo, he's out there. There's a dog out there, dude. There's a dog out there. Uh, yo, I am too scared to go out there, dude. I, I don't know. I, I just, I have nothing. I have nothing. All I can really do is take my shoes off and like throw it at him. That's, that's the best I can do right now. Do you see his shadow? Do you see his shadow? What would you guys do? Would you guys go out there or would you guys like kind of like stay in here? Let me see if I can push this. Alright guys, oh, we're gonna have to do it, we're gonna have to do it. Alright, one, two, 
and oh god be with me Jesus three up oh, all right all right he doesn't notice me he doesn't notice me keep running Alex keep running all right we're safe we are safe oh my god ah! dude oh, oh no 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 don't don't oh, there's two of them oh how many dogs are there dude I this whole parking lot is full of dogs oh my god there's another one dude dude what is going on there's more in the parking lot oh my god oh my god dude all right we're gonna have to go down here oh all right oh my this is terrifying this is way more terrifying than the original i'm gonna have to save my game i'm gonna have to save my game because i i know if i go up there i i have to go up there guys I have to go up there and I know once I go back up there I'm going to die because there's like 12 dogs and there's me with a bulletproof vest an empty shotgun and two bullets where the hell am I okay there's the uh, secret room oh my god there's not much I can go off of here all right well I'm gonna have to go to the jail cell to put that electrical part in Let's see if I can do... Oh, they're waiting for me. Look at these dogs. Look at the... Uh, the bad dogs, bad dogs, bad puppies. Stay back, stay back. Stay back for the love of everything that's holy. Okay, we made it. Uh, where am I? Jesus. Let me, let me see if I can go through here. So as long as these jail cells remain closed, I'll be fine. So... Let me just make my way through here. Wait, what the hell was that? Did you, guys, did you guys just hear that? It sounded like a gate just opened. Is there anything over there? All right, um, whatever. Let's just put this, uh, okay, we have two, po uh, let me see, let me just use this. Okay, uh, oh man, wait a minute. Okay, so, wait, hold on. Oh, I see. We need another part. We need another part. Um, I don't really have anything here. So we're going to have to look for the other part then, because we can't really do much without the other part. Okay, so one more part, and then we can open up this jail cell to grab this guy's little badge, so we can unlock the parking lot garage and get the hell out of here. Wait, doesn't that mean that if I unlock the jail cells that these gates are going to open too? That's not good. That's not good at all, actually. Alright, so we're going to have to go back out there. I'm going to have to go through that control room then. Oh, jeez. All right, guys. Wish me luck on this one. All right. Five, four, three, two, and... Oh, man. Should I go through it? Uh, one. Okay. Okay. The dogs don't notice me. Yo, he almost got me on that one. Listen, I am not food. I am a person. All right? I, I am a person. I have sweaty balls, and I'm fairly certain you don't want to eat a person that has sweaty balls. Please let me escape. Please let me escape. Please let me escape. The, the sad thing is... I'm going to have to come and go through that twice more. Once to put the electrical part in, and the second time is to unlock the garage. Where the hell are I? What, where, what is this? Where am I? Whoa. Okay. Um, I think I remember this in the original game. But let me just... Uh, let me explore. Uh, okay. So we are... Okay. There's a staircase here. All right. So nonetheless, what's inside door number one? What's inside of here? Uh, we have some blue marijuanas. And a typewriter. Oh, hell yeah. I'm saving my game for sure. Blue Herb. I am going to save my game because I don't want to lose any data. We went through hell just trying to get through that. And can you imagine playing this game on hardcore? Nobody surviving. Hands down. Nobody surviving. This game is just so good, guys. This game is so good. What is that? Um, let me just explore this. What do we have here? We have mag ammo. Um, I guess I'll take it, I suppose. Even though we don't have a mag. What is this? Electrical part. Alright, uh, but we don't have any space. So, I think what I'm going to do... Yeah, you know what? Um, do I need this? Or... As a, matter of, as a matter of fact, let me just get rid of these damn wooden boards. Because I really don't need them, to be honest. Or maybe I do. I don't know. Maybe I made a foolish mistake by getting rid of it. So, now we have an electrical part. So, I'm just trying to think. Is this the same part that I'm supposed to use... In one of the hallways gunpowder uh, can I combine that don't really care uh, is that ammo yes it is okay so I have an idea hold on I have an idea I am going to get rid of something here what am I gonna get rid of uh, I guess I'm going to get rid of damn 
All right, let me just get rid of that and grab onto this. What I'm gonna do is combine that with my gunpowder so I can have uh, ammo, shotgun ammo, which is good. Now I'm gonna switch on over to my shotgun, load my shotty up, I'm gonna grab me that handgun ammo, equip that, load up my handgun, and now we're good to go. Perfect. All right, so uh, being that, let me see what I have here. I can't use that, I really, I really need to use that, but let me just save my game one more time because anything can happen right now as I'm making my way out there, so. But guys, leave your thoughts in the comment section below as to how you guys feel about this. What are your overall thoughts as to what you guys would do in a situation like this? Where, uh, let me see, fuse, break room, hallway. Is this the one that I need downstairs or? Cause obviously um, this resembles one of the stationary units that I can use for the, the uh, downstairs area. Break room, hallway starter, okay. All right, um, I guess I'm gonna grab this and I'm just gonna see what I can do with it so far. I'm just trying to piece together certain things. Anything else here that I need? No. All right. Uh, ooh, what's this? Turn this on. Finally, we have some light. Let me just take one last look around because maybe the darkness got to me. Uh, nothing here, okay. Time for us to escape. All right, now, now I'm beginning to get a little nervous. All right, so what is on this? Oh, what the hell was that? What the hell was that? Oh, zombies by the window. Oh my God. Hello. Hello there, partners. Oh crap, they're coming. Listen, I'm gonna warn you. Yeet. One to the head and one to the neck. Third one to the neck. All right, this guy's next. Yeet. Got him in the neck. Back up. Back up. I missed. All right, you know what the hell with all this? Yeet! He ain't getting back out of- Yo, he's not getting up after that. No way possible. Oh, look at this dude. He's feasting. You having fun there, buddy? Nah, not on my watch. Are you kidding me? Dude, are you- I blew his spine out. Oh, this guy's up too. Shit. Um, gonna have to put him down. And I have no more shotgun shells. Yeet! 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 Wow, man, I wasted so much ammo. I wasted so much ammo on things that didn't make any sense. Let me grab this uh, knife here. Finally, we have ourselves our combat knife back again. Oh, there we go, okay. And now the gate's going to be lifted. Oh, it's our friend. It's our friend. What up, homie? Long time no see. Oh man, all right, so what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna go back real quick. And I'm gonna save all that because I don't want to lose my data. I don't want to go back and like lose my data if I die. So it's better to save than to go out there blindly, I think. Just saying because I don't want to be the guy that's gonna die or whatever. But listen, this has been such an enjoyable series. And I want to thank you all so much for sticking by and watching this with me because I murdered a lot of friends here today. Oh, what the hell? Oh, look, it's Spiral. It's Spiral. You ain't getting in here, Spiral. I know what you're looking for. You're hungry for some meat, aren't you? Oh my god, there's Fox. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> Alright, um, I, I normally hate this side of the hallway, but I need to figure something out because, and the reason for that is because I got jumped by so many zombies before that I'm not willing to risk it. What the hell was that? Is there a zombie here? I have to run through. This is my Discord server on any time when there's a debate. It's just utter chaos. Utter chaos. I wonder if, um... If that officer is alive or dead it's been about it's been a long time let me see if he's alive um typically enough we made it back okay cool now we're gonna have to figure some stuff out because now this is where things are going to get very interesting in one of many different ways so I'm gonna save my game and I'm going to figure out how to get the hell out of this damn police station because I'm not sure how many more hours we have until they have to bomb the entire city but if that, you know, or maybe that was Resident Evil 3, I forgot. Oh, hey, Mar- what the- oh, he's a zombie. I knew it! Marvin! Marvin! Stay down. I'm- I'm- I'm Damn only gonna it. tell you once. Stay down, Spiral! Yay! Spiral! I'm not giving you my meat today. Is he down? Is he down for sure? Okay. See, I should've done this. I should've done this before. Damn it. Alright, I'm gonna have to figure something out. Wait, okay, so- Looking at the map, uh, there is something in the library that I can do in order for me to get to where I want to be. There's a, My knife is right there, obviously. 
Um, the third floor, perhaps, maybe, I can get somewhere. There's a dialogue here. However, I need to use that crank. I just need to figure out where. Is it on the second floor? Let me see, waiting room. The safe is here. The emperor statue. Then we have the staircase. Oh, there we go. Yep, the crank handle slot. That's where we need to go. Second floor, through the waiting room, all the way upstairs. And then we have to use that crank handle in order for us to get to the next side of, or to, to the other side of the police department. All right, so we're making progress. We are making progress. Listen, like I said before, we need a Resident Evil 3 Nemesis remake. That would be godly. And then can you imagine if they go as far as making the Resident Evil 4 remake? Oh, dude, that would be the most legendary thing ever. All right, so any zombies here that I'm supposed to be aware of? Nope, all right. Let's just go right through here, yeah? There we go. I remember this. All right, so let's put this here. Let's go on ahead and unlock the other part of the, the uh, police department. Oh, this is spooky stuff. This is so spooky. All right, uh, what's on this side? I'm a little nervous. Anybody here? Zombies, Mr. X. There's a staircase. One that goes up and one that goes down. Okay, so this is going to take us to all right we have the boiler room the interrogation room okay so we're making progress if we go downstairs however the upstairs area is still unknown but the downstairs area still holds some mystery uh okay that's the upstairs area all right so uh let me just look for some stuff first uh what what key is this can i try this by any chance damn it it's the heart key all right, um, I need to find those damn keys, man. I, I would shoot this, but I really don't want to waste ammo. So, upstairs or downstairs? All right, uh, oh, man. I'm going downstairs then, folks. Wish me luck. Hello? Anybody down here? Any zombies down here? Oh, great. That door's already open. Wonderful. Wonderful. I am so nervous. Oh, hi! Hi! Oh, he's pissed. You want some beef? Huh? You want some meat? You ain't getting my meat. There's a zombie right there, too. Damn. Okay, so... I don't I don't know where to... Am I supposed to go ahead? Hopefully enough, these doors can lead me somewhere. Um, The interrogation room, the boiler room. Let me go over here first. Let me see if there's anything here I can, I can actually use. What the hell was that? Oh, they got in. They got in. What is this? Uh, gunpowder. Ah, I don't really need that. Anything more? Uh, damn, they're in. They're in. All right, Lucky Charms key is right there. And uh, let me just check real quick. Yep, he's in here. And which one is this? This is the heart key. Damn it. Oh, back up, back up, back up, back up. All right, run, 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 run. See, I'm smart. I'm smart. At least, at least, that kind of like uh, rattled him a bit just to pause. But, you know, like, the, the whole mechanic system for, like, get zombies getting shot in the head is so different in this game. Because in the original, you shoot them, like, three or four times, they go down. Here, you shoot them, they keep coming back. All right, we have two doors. Uh, by the time the zombie comes upstairs, I should be all clear what's inside of here. Uh, what is that? Yes, handgun ammo. Definitely something that I needed. All right, let's just continue our journey. What the hell? Oh, boy. This isn't spooky at all. Sus. Super sus. Uh, blue marijuana, uh, can I combine them? Let me see if I can combine them. Can I combine them? I can't. Okay, so essentially they're both useless to me. So I'm gonna get rid of this. And, uh, carry on with my mission. This is so sus right now. I am so, I, I'm so, like, worried right now. Where is this? The large, uh, the east storage room. Oh, there's a large gear there. Okay. Let me see. Oh, where is it? Is that it? There it is. Large gear, okay? Uh, damn. I need to get rid of something. Um, let me get rid of... Damn, this sucks. Let me get rid of the crank. Let me also try to get rid of, uh... How do you move stuff again? Oh, there we go. Hold on, let me see. Square. Alright, put that there. We're gonna grab the gear. I, I think I have to go to the library to add that gear. So, but you listen, I, I don't trust this at all. I, I don't trust any of this. 
Let me see. Um, damn, shotgun shells. We're going to have to get rid of the uh, the blue herb. Sorry. Don't really need that to my disposal right now. I'm going to reload my shotgun because you'll never know what something may... Uh, what the hell was that? Oh, my God. Hello. And goodbye. Damn. Thank God I didn't walk any closer. Did you, I, I hear more of them. I, oh, there it is. Uh, I, I knew I heard more of them. Hi, sir. Yeet. That should be it. I, I blew his freaking... I blew his neck off. Both of them should not be able to stand back up. Because one dude doesn't have a spine to stand up. And the other one's basically immobile. Is he still moving? I have no idea. What the hell was that? Wait, which one is moving? Aw, oh, crap. I'm stuck. Uh... That dude's already up, and this guy's moving. Oh god, Leon, run. Is there any way... Let me see if I can use this door. Can I use this door? Can I use this door? No, I can't. Aw, oh, this sucks. This sucks. I can't use that door. How are those dudes alive? Can someone explain that to me? How are they alive? Let me go through here. Uh, what the hell? Oh, this is the, uh, this is the rooftop. Okay. Alright, um, I have to put that fire out. I have that feeling, guys, once I put that fire out, Mr. X is gonna pursue me. I know that for a fact. Oh, 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 god, oh god, no, 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 bad timing, bad timing, bad timing, hang, hang on! Oh, wow. Are you serious? Great, just my luck, just my freaking luck, man. I could still climb that. Damn it. Are you kidding me? You could still climb that. Just, you know, climb it from the sides. Um, what do we have here? There's the fire. Yeah, this is the rooftop area. Definitely the rooftop area. It takes us downstairs, over to the art... Okay, so... I think I have an idea as to where I would like to go and what to do. Let me turn this on to put the fire out. Here we go, guys. Alright, uh... What the hell? Oh, none of that worked. Okay. None of that worked. That was basically useless. Okay. So, I need to, uh... Oh, yes. Handgun ammo. Immediately spotted that one. I'm gonna have to take a different approach. Because for us to progress, we need to take that fire out. Like, we need to take that fire out ASAP. Uh, let's just go down here. I remember all of this. I remember this now as a kid. Damn, I haven't I haven't seen this in years. What the hell is that noise? What the hell is that noise? Do you guys hear that or am I bugging out? It, it sounds like someone's trying to rev something up. All right, let's just put this here. Let's go on ahead and use that. All right, finally. Now now we're on fine. Perfect. Y'all heard that, right? I'm not bugging out. Let me see. It came from here. Anybody here by any chance? Anybody here? No, I don't see anything. All right, so... Oh, Jesus, it's you guys! Back, I say! All right. How is she... Oh, I just wasted a shotgun round, man. Get down, right to the head. I said stay down, right to the head. Damn, man. All right, I, I shot that one dude in the face. Let's just switch this to left. Okay. So that means the water now should be going towards the left side. So we should be able to put the fire out. Uh, any items here I can use? What is this? Gunpowder. Oh, Jesus. The hell with your gunpowder, man. I don't really need this. All right. Uh, what is this? Oh, perfect. We can save our game. All right. So uh, what the hell is on this wall here? Oh, the leprechaun key. Yes, the clover key. All right. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to save my game real quick. This is this has been intense, man. As a matter of fact, let me grab that key before I save. Cause that that's the key that I need to get by. Either way, everybody, I do want to say thank you all so much for watching this episode of the Resident Evil 2 remake. I hope you guys had a great time. I hope you guys tune back in for part six. It's going to get really crazy. It really is. So let me just uh go ahead and save my game real quick. Someone lose a key. That's funny. Either way, everybody, I want to thank you all so much. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, guys. Slap a like down below. Tune back in for the next video, and I'll be seeing each and every single one of you guys 
for part six of the Resident Evil 2 remake. Take it easy, everybody. Peace!